Hello students, welcome back to SciMath videos. This is a short video on how to prove the basic proportionality theorem or else called as this Thale theorem, Thales theorem or else it is also called as the BPT theorem, basic proportionality theorem, BPT or Thale theorem. Okay, why do we, this theorem comes in your triangles chapter. Before going to theorem, we will just brush up with the concept that we learnt in our lower classes. What is that concept? If there are two triangles, Okay, one triangle like this, <coughs> one triangle like this, just imagine there are one parallel line like this, two parallel line, okay. Let this be your one triangle and this be your one more triangle, I will just shade it, okay. <coughs> so this is your one triangle and just one more triangle is, if you see here, this is your one more triangle, okay. One more triangle. We had studied in the lower class. What have we studied? Okay. See now what is the area of triangle? What is the area of triangle formula? We know the area of triangle formula. It is area is equal to half into base into height. Okay. Now see the both the triangles. For both the triangles, if I want the area, what I will do for this triangle? It is this base. What I want to calculate the area of this triangle? It is again the same base for both the triangle. Let me take this triangle one and triangle 2. For triangle 1, area is half is common formula, base, this is the base, okay, height, this is the height, okay, this is a parallel line, okay, parallel line, we know what is a parallel line, a line just like a railway track and the, and the distance between the parallel lines are always same. So, this is H, okay. Now, let me then, what is the area of area, one more triangle, this triangle area, same base and same height, height is always, it cannot, this cannot be height, height is always the straighter one, okay, the straight which is 90 degree, okay, this perpendicular one, okay, so this again same b into height, so what is the knowledge that we are learning here, the concept here is, if there are two triangles which is having same base, is having same base, okay, which has same base and on same parallels, then both the triangle area will be same. This both area is same, right? Yes. So, this we need to understand, this we know to do the BPT theorem. Let us go to the BPT theorem. Okay. First, in the theorem, we need to know the definition. In the examination, nobody will be giving you the definition. Okay. You have to, uh, you have to know the definition of the theorem. Okay. So, what is the definition? If a line is drawn uh, according to the definition, let us also draw the diagram. I had already drawn here. But let us draw a rough diagram, okay. So, if a line, if a line is drawn, okay, if a line is drawn parallel to one side of a triangle, okay, let me take this is one side of a triangle and let me draw one parallel line here, okay. Let me mention the triangle as ABC, okay. Let me mention this parallel line as DE, any one side. It, I can even draw like this, I can even draw like this, but let me draw like this. If a line is parallel to one side of a triangle, to intersect at other two ends at distinct points, it is intersected. Then the other two sides are divided in same ratio. That means, that means what to prove, see to prove very clear it is AD, AD by DB is equal to AE by EC. This by this is equal to this by this. See what? AD by DB is equal to AE by EC. Okay. So now given, what is the given? Given the triangle was given and in, in, the, in the definition itself, okay, it is very clear that there is one triangle and there is one line which is parallel to one of the side of the triangle. That is what DE, this is DE which is parallel to BC. That is given and to prove, we just know what to prove. <coughs> now let us go to the proof. Now we should know one concept here. The basic proportionality theorem is nothing to do with the angles. It is, com it is entirely doing with the sides length of the side. So, illi, whenever they are using, whenever you have to find the length of the side, basically most of the times you, you need to know the area, area of the triangle, then only you can calculate the length of anything. Okay. So, here it is, BPT is nothing but the, uh, everything is about the length here. Okay. So, what is the construction? The construction is simple, just listen, let's see the diagram here. Here I have done mixed both, just first how to do, join BE okay, and join AE. Why I am joining, I will tell you. Join this and mention this as F. How to join this is your join BE, drop EF perpendicular to AD. 
perpendicular sin i have drawn see a this is ad draw one line perpendicular to ad okay this is the first construction okay now what what do i want here see ad by db i want see ad by db so what i will do i will apply the concept of area here okay for what two triangles let me apply let me take two triangles if there are two triangles here okay one triangle if you see here this is the topmost triangle one more triangle is this triangle which one see this both triangle this triangle and this triangle this full triangle this is the two triangle i will take why i am taking this two triangle i want ratio i want ad by db okay now i will apply the area see i will apply the area formula okay what is area formula for ade half into area ade half into base what is the base ad is the base see base is where the perpendicular comes okay okay you know no half into base into height means height should always be the median it must be perpendicular to the side this is the height this is the base and this is the height for the triangle so here this is the base and this is the height half into half into ad into ef this is the height next triangle the bottom triangle dbe this is the bottom triangle uh, bottom triangle right here what is the base half into base db is the base db is the, what is the height see here we must be very careful if you just invert like this see i just inverted like this this see what is the height for this triangle this is not the height see this is not the height must be perpendicular right this is the height this is not the height for this bottom triangle okay it is outside but it is not inside it is outside here okay this is the height see i just inverted and showed now come back okay so now what is the height ef is only height for both of them ef, EF only is the height what you draw perpendicular to ad this only is the height why i just showed now see here see perpendicular half into base into this is the height okay height is see the perpendicular one always okay now you see now half into base uh, this triangle half into base into height okay now i want just ad by db right here in the proof i want ad by db what i should do i have to divide the ratios or else i will not get ad by db divide the ratios how to divide the ratio just write divide both the ratio and if you see here half and half will get goes away ef ef goes away cancel cancel gone what is remaining this is remaining okay you are dividing the see this triangle area of this triangle by area of this triangle okay so i'll i'll just write this as equation number 1 okay this is right equal next 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 now i should go to what i want next now i want this side ae by you see i want this by the same logic this side you apply i'll put one more triangle now just for this that you will not get confused one more triangle so i'll put bc here i'll write a here and de here okay now what i want now i want this side this both side so join what should i join i should not join be here okay i should join this and this and draw perpendicular to this one right dg some naming you you have given g here perpendicular dg per joint dc and draw dg perpendicular to ae correct same thing that we done here i am doing now here now what are the two triangles here this is the one triangle and this is the one more triangle okay two triangle now area of two triangle okay see ade this top triangle is same for both ade 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 half half into base what is the base for this triangle now this is the base because the median is here height is here this is the base ae okay ae i let ae dg this is the height perpendicular one dg next now the bottom triangle this is the bottom triangle okay half into base what is the base ec is the base what is the height just see here just if i enter this here i told you the perpendicular one should be the height so again dg is the itself the height again dg is the height itself see dg okay ec by ec into dg again you divide both the ratios this and this cancels of dg dc cancels so you will be remained with c i want ad by c i want ad by db it is already here i want ae by ec already here now write this as equation 2 now if i want to equate this and this i have to also make i have to tell that this both are equal this both are equal right this i should tell this both are equal okay now let us see the uh, now now we come back to the important concept here that just now in the beginning i taught you if you see here this one and this one the numerator is same no problem the numerator denominator see the denominator deb triangle deb see triangle deb this triangle triangle here see triangle dec 
what sorry uh, triangle DEC this triangle yes this triangle this triangle and this triangle just now in the beginning we learned what did we, we learn we learned that see same parallel these both are parallel we know it is from the base proportionality the D is parallel to BC <coughs> a parallel means same height same base two triangle on same base on same height we just learned in the beginning of the class okay we learned in the beginning of the class two triangles same height same base the area will be same so can you tell this and this are equal if this and this are equal okay just in place of DEB can I write DEC and again in uh, now this both are equal if this both are equal obviously this both will be equal now correct I see numerator was same denominator also becomes same how we know that area this one is equal to area this one this area by this area denominator why because both these triangles are on same base DE and same parallels BC and DE correct this is the parallels and same okay same base DE is the base and there are two parallels that is why area is same now if it is very clear now it is very clear see numerator is same for both of it so now I can replace DEC with DB also this both will become equal if this both become equal can I not equate this both I can definitely equate this and this so I have equated so I should write from 1 2 and 3 AD by DE this is the hence proof hopefully you understood the theorem okay so this is the you can take the screenshot okay and this is if in a link provided you can download this paper you can download in the link below okay or you can just take a screenshot of it and study this is a simple method of basic proportionality theorem thank you and kindly subscribe